The review considered that the word crumpet is likely to be considered as describing women as a sexual object in a demeaning way and would cause offence if it were to appear on the ballot paper. The leader of the party, Ray Hall, will have to change the name before they can be reconsidered for the general election. Ray has some fresh ideas for a new party title. Beer Backy and Squeaky Wheel Party. Um, the Beer Backy and Je Suis Charlie Party. Uh, the Beer Backy and Crumpets Party, which would take out of the equation uh, <coughs> the possibility of ladies possibly feeling demeaned. The, the name is quirky, but the proposals and the policies are very, very serious. Some women in Eastleigh are unconvinced that there is anything in the old party name that might cause offence. Okay, well I like crumpets, so I think it's ridiculous. It's a bit stupid, really, because it's like, it's a food. Like, you can't ban foods. <laughs> it's, um, it's... It's not harming anyone, so it's no point. It's not like it's a rude word, it's just a word, really. So I don't really see why it should be banned. On March the 7th, the party will cease to officially exist, costing hundreds of pounds to relaunch. Ray will be on the politics show on the BBC with Andrew Neil tomorrow. Henry Nixon, Winchester News Online, Eastleigh. Launching their campaign in the South, UKIP opened their doors to the people of Eastleigh. We want to be a real presence in this constituency, so we're not just trying to hide away. We're, neither are we here to knock everybody else. I'm a great believer in cooperation, so we're here to support what's good, and I'm very keen to do that. The party came second in the 2013 Eastleigh by-election, and they're full of hot air this week. But what else do they have in store to keep their support on the rise? This is our latest Winchester poll. Taking over 30 responses each week over the last month added together gives us an increasingly accurate picture. We now have reached over 150 results. A clear picture is emerging with the Conservatives polling highest amongst students, a group least likely to vote. The left of centre vote is split between Greens and Labour, while Lib Dems and UKIP are floundering on campus with only 4% of the vote between them. If our poll is to be believed, it shows a close battle between three parties and no clear overall winner.